I don't even know where to start with all of this. But, you know, a lot of people have said, oh, man, he just needs to come back. Just come back and work a program with the Bucks and Kenny Omega, and everybody's going to make a lot of money. And I've been trying to tell people for months and months and months and months that it's it's not that easy. It's not just, oh, come back and make a lot of money. I mean, I've been saying this for months, and Dave finally said it on Wednesday. And that is, who's going to make money off of this? This is not WWE in the 90s. Everybody is not under these, uh, whatever they call them, downside guarantees. Nobody gets bonuses for house shows. Nobody gets bonuses for pay-per-views. There are zero bonuses. Everybody is on a guarantee. And so if the Young Bucks and CM Punk work together and business explodes, they make no money. Now, sure, granted, maybe when it's time to re-sign, maybe they can get a better deal. Maybe they would. Maybe they won't. I don't know. But the idea that, hey, we're going to pop the house. Everybody's going to go. No, you're not going to make more money. No one's making any more money off of this. Okay? Then you've got the larger issue of people that really don't like each other and they don't want to work together and they don't want to have anything to do with each other. And the other thing would be always go, oh, uh, Brian, Dave, take inside. Listen, forget, forget anyone's side. Okay. The fact of the matter is that the Young Bucks and Kenny Omega and Chris Jericho And John Moxley and all of these guys are very, very well liked within the company. They people love working with them. They they love them as as people. They have a lot. Forget anybody outside of AEW. Forget any reporters or anybody. These are very, very well liked people. And they are being buried they are being we had a fight involving them i mean i've said i don't think this guy is coming back i don't know if he's coming back or not it's very clear he wants to come back he has not been released he has not been fired okay so i don't know what's going to happen but i'm telling you right now this is not going to be an easy situation to just bring him back He's not going to walk in and everyone's going to be happy to see him. Sure, there are people there that like CM Punk. There are CM Punk supporters. And it's not just FTR. Obviously, they're big supporters of CM Punk. There are others as well. But they are... Anyway. Loading up on some liquid energy here. Uncle Howdy. Why does he do this? Why does he do this? <laughs> That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. Why does he do that? me to explain Uncle Howdy. Yes. Someone needs to put that to music, some 70s song, for the best of the Brian and Vinny show. Yeah, keep it off this show, please. Why does he do this? Why does he do this? That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. We're going to get kicked off whatever run. You just disgusted Granny. That's like the Uncle Howdy thing. What a jamming song that is. Yeah, keep it off this show, please. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of the Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, the Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.